This week, we're going to talk about how to fix this incompatibility error between matplotlib3 and cartopy 0.16 that a lot of you are seeing. Welcome to another MatPy Monday. Hello, I'm John Lehman, a software engineer at Unidata. On this week's MetPy Monday, I wanted to demonstrate how to roll back a version of a specific package with Conda to fix an error that many of you are running into. So here I've got one of our notebooks from the Unidata Python workshop materials on plotting model fields. And this is just a pretty standard block here. We're doing some Cartopy things. We're making a projection, setting up a figure, adding a plot. And then we're trying to use P color mesh to plot some data on this map. And we get an error. If you scroll all the way down, the error is relatively cryptic of geoaxy subplot has no attribute underscore hold. And you might say, well, this script worked not long ago. And that's true. In matplotlib 3.0, which, by the way, is the first Python 3 only release of matplotlib. A lot of the original pyplot machinery was removed, the sort of MATLAB-like interface. And as part of that, hold went away. Hold will be familiar to those of you that are MATLAB users or recovering MATLAB users, but it's not really used in the matplotlib object-oriented style of plotting. So they've removed that, and Cartopy was checking for that attribute as part of several methods, including p color mesh. So right now, until matplotlib 3.0.1 and or Cartopy 0.17 come out, the easiest way is to roll back to matplotlib 2 for a little bit. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, so we're here in our terminal, and your prompt will probably look different, but as you can see, I am in the environment that I want to be working in. In this case, I'm in the Unidata workshop environment. That's where I'm running my notebook from. So if I run the command conda list, you'll see all the packages that are installed in this environment. If we scroll up, we can see that matplotlib3 is installed and cartopy 0.16. What we want to do is roll back to matplotlib2 and keep cartopy 0.16. If you just roll back to matplotlib2, Conda will probably downgrade you to 0.15, in which case you don't have state outlines and some other things like that. So the way we're going to do this is with the command conda install, just like we want to install a new package, and then matplotlib equals 2, Cartopy equals 0.16. So that will have us install the most recent matplotlib 2. Dot whatever that we can with Cartopy 0.16. In this case, it's going to be matplotlib 2.2. .2. So we go ahead and run that command. Conda is going to solve our environment for us and let us know what needs to be done. If you're not using Conda for your Python environment and package management, I highly recommend it. And we've got some videos, some of the first MetPy Monday videos, in fact, that talk about the basics of Conda. So here it's going to ask if we want to proceed, and I'm going to press return to accept the default, which is yes. So we're going to download any necessary packages, do our transaction, and we're done. Now if I run the Conda list command again, and we go back up here and look, matplotlib 2.2.3, and let's verify that our cartopy stayed where we wanted it at 0 0.16. Okay, so now we're going to go back to the notebook, or your script, or whatever you have. I'm going to restart the kernel, and then I am going to run all above. So that should get us back to where we were with the error previously. And there's our map made with p color mesh. 
So sometimes package incompatibilities do happen, though the Python ecosystem tries to be very good about things like this not happening. Sometimes they do. Being able to read those error messages, Google around, go look at issues on the affected repositories, and then use Conda to simply roll back. Uh, that's one of the beautiful things about Conda is it makes it easy for us to solve an issue like this. I hope that you found this useful, and we'll see you on next week's MetPy Monday.